Welcome guys, this is Edwin, and today we're going to be looking at a couple of traditionals I recently got that I haven't made a video and show you guys. So let's make a quick video on this. And yes, guys, I still love my GECs, like you know. And I know it's hard to find, not easy. It's one of those things that sometimes I score one and sometimes I miss. So it happens, you know, it's, it's that part of the whole collection and and let me tell you if you're asking yourself does edwin really carry a pocket knife the answer is yes let me show you i carry one of these two okay usually is this one the gc number 35 and you can see it's been used and abused it's been taken a lot in the pocket you know i just drop it right there in my pocket and i love this little knife love this little blade right here like you can see and yes guys i use it it's really really nice really love this pattern it has this beard tool right here that i use sometimes i will say and then this beer opener right really important really important and that that kind of fork right there you know that you can see it's been used as well so i really enjoy this knife really different and usually it's you know, one of those conversation starters for sure. And I love it. The beer and sausage and look at those covers, right? Really, really nice. So this is one of my EDCs. And when I want something smaller, then I go. And again, this is the GEC 35. Okay. And when I want something smaller, then I go with this white owl. And this model is the 60, the model 68 love that clip point really useful and like you can see it's been used as well i carry it i use it love it and it comes with this little pen blade that i don't use that much but it's there just in case but really like how lightweight and how easy it is to handle this one as well okay so one of these two the white owl or the gec 35 is constantly in my rotation and i love carrying and pairing a a, you know a tactical knife or a, you know a locking folder with a pocket knife okay now let me show you the couple of GECs I recently got let's start with this one this is the GEC 88 with black linen micarta okay this is the 88 ace and here we are it's a beautiful beautiful pattern right there this guy right here is called the Bayou Trapper, I think, and in the model name, like you can see, model name 88, the blade style is number eight. Ah, that's It's like a clip point, I will say. It comes with two blades, that's what that means, right? And then manufacturing 2022, and again, black linen micarta. Let's look at this. It's a beautiful, beautiful pattern. They did several releases. It's the only one I was able to get, but it's a beauty, and I love that shield. That ace shield looks really, really cool. And again, like expected from GEC, perfect construction, no question about it. And I love it. Really, really nice. This is this main blade. It's kind of a clip point. It has a specific name. I forgot about it, but you can see a very nice style of blade right there. Like you can see. And then he had that stamp, that 88A stamp there. Carbon steel 1095 that I love in my traditionals. It has that half stop. Great, 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 great action. And then you have this beautiful sheep's foot is what I will call that, right? Very useful, very useful style of knife right there. That's where the model name is, right? That 88, EC 88, and it's another beautiful blade and execution. And this one they did really really nice okay and again this is the gec 88 let me show you how it compare against my gec 35 that is the one i'm currently carrying so let me show you just so you get an idea bigger than the 35 so get an idea right there okay how it compares and in terms of thickness that's how it looks okay but again a beauty really like that black linen micarta i think they did a great job with it with those colors and again another look at this beautiful gec 88 and now the second one i got is this barlow right here the gec 14 with a golden rod 
saw cut or saw cut bone right handles you know or covers i will say very very good and it has the whole no bs barlow right there and this one one thing that caught me by surprise that it's a little bit it's smaller it's a little barlow right here the tc really nice in those in you know in those bolsters right there and that saw cut very very nice okay those covers are really really nice on this one a smaller knife but i really like the execution on it you can see the really really nice work that gec put on this one again the gec 14 there's that half stop right there and then that's how it open a little bit weak on that action have that beautiful switch i love the long pole so it's something that I really look, I like how it looks. And you can see in terms of stamps, you have that right there. And then on the back will be that GEC Carbon Steel 141122. And a beautiful execution on that blade as well. And guys, this guy is way smaller. You know, it's something that I probably won't carry. It's very, very small, but I love to have it in my collection. This is how it looks against the GEC 35. Let me bring this small one that is one that I usually carry, but you can see it's bigger, right? It's bigger than that little GEC 14 Barlow. Really elegant. If you're looking for something small that you can put in your, you know, in your pocket, hey, this will work for you. I do love that style of clip point that they do and really, really nice. And guys, like I mentioned, they Two GECs I got in my collection. I still love in pocket knives. I think they're really, really cool to carry and keeping that tradition going. And again, the GEC number 88 right here, Ace 88, and the GEC number 14, the Barlow right there that they recently released. And again, guys, if you have any questions, feel free to jump in on my YouTube comments. And of course, in Calo PR on Instagram that I'm always there sharing daily pictures for you guys. And you know, in caloblade.com, you can find on the recommendation all the links of the main groups that were always hanging around. Okay, guys, you guys have a great, great day out there. Bye.